How's it going guys? Mirror B here, back again with another Yu-Gi-Oh! opening video. Um, I'm very excited for this one guys because like I mentioned the last time, we've got uh, three boxes of this to go through. I'm very, very excited for it. But today, box number one of Darkwing Blast. And as you guys can guess, the Black Wings are back, baby. And I am more then excited to get some of these for my Blackwing deck. See if I can get this popped open here. There we go. Be very, very careful with my scissors. So I don't accidentally cut the box or anything else. Oh, come on. Come on, plastic wrap. Nope. There we go. Slowly but surely. Hey, presto. We got one box of Darkwing Blast. Can we get some black wings out of this bad boy? Among other things, I think someone said there's new Naturia stuff in here too. Um, kind of hope there is. That'd be nice for my uh, Hidden Arsenal tournament series that I still have yet to make a video on for you guys. I really got to work on that. But, uh, we will get that going for you at some point. Start with our first pack of the Blackwing Excitement. Let's see, we gotta do four to the front. We got Frakey the Runic Fangs, Fusion Monster, Psychic Rover, Naturia Camellia, there are new Naturias here. Kagero the Cannon Ninja. I guess there's new ninjas in here too. Tri Brigade Showdown. Scareclaw Twin Saw. Amazonus Pet Liger King. There's also Amazonuses. Uh, Soul Scissors. What the heck? Never heard of it. And Blackwing Chinook the Snow Blast. So new Blackwing. Right off the bat, we've got, I'm going to keep these up here Naturias, Blackwings, Amazonuses. Several different uh, decks here that we're looking for. I guess ninjas too. My brother's always on the lookout for more ninja cards. So it's our one pack. We've already got four uh, four different things we're looking for stuff from. So I am liking liking the look of this. Can throw something out of the way, guys. Sorry about that. Let's see. Here we go. Four to the front. Tier Laments Grief. Kagero the Cannon Ninja again. Blackwing Twin Shadow, new trap card for him. Laughing Puffin, okay. Soul Scissors, Ninjutsu Art Tool, Iron Digger, new ninja card. Naturia Mole Cricket, Zalamander Catalyzer, never heard of that thing. And Blackwing Vata the Emblem of Wandering, so that's already... Two different black, two black wings in a row. It's uh, that's some good luck. I'm liking the look of this. Liking the look of it. Let's see. We've got Naturia Blessing, a new uh, quick play spell for him. Silent Wolf Kalupo. The Great Noodle Inversion. <laughs> What's okay? Black Shadow Squall. There's a. Black, black wing dragon trap. Remove a black feather counter. Yep, sure do. So there's a new black wing. Verna Sylph in full bloom. Kashtira preparations. Ixeep Omen of the Goaty. Tear Laments Heartbeat. And it's a super. Simul Archfiends. Okay, never. Don't even know what that does. Something to do with all the different summoning mechanics, I can tell you that much, including rituals. I can tell you that. Two, three, four. Let's see, Dragonic Pendulum. Oh, that's a that's a Draco Slayer, actually. Nice uh Draco Slayer card. I'm gonna, you know, I'll keep those out just in case. It's a Curse of Aramatur. Era it's an adventurer card. Bayer Rock Dragon. That's a that's a dinosaur. It's not a dragon. Naturia Camellia again. Verna Sylph in full bloom. 
Omen of the Goatee, Cash Tira Preparations, Tier Limit Scream, and Branded Beast. Uh, beast Branded or Beastial. Whatever those are. Oh, I wish they had more stuff that I actually recognized. It would be very nice. One, two, three, four. Let's see. Celestial Apparatus Tezia. Tezia. It's another adventurer card. Dragonic Pendulum, again. Bear Rock Dragon. Amazonus Golden Whip Master. Okay, they got pendulums now, apparently. Zalamander Catalyzer. Turbo Tainted Hot Rod GT19. Okay, that's a, that's a new one. Amazonist Spiritualist. Amazonist War Chief. Okay, double double Amazonist in this one. And, ooh, this is a, it's an ultra. Destructive Daruma Karma Cannon. That's a mouthful. What's that do? Change as many monsters on the field as possible to face down defense position. Then if either player controls a face-up monster or monsters, they must send all face-up monsters they control to the grave. That is flat out uh, ghost trick, ghost tricks right there. I almost bet money on that. Flip everything face down, and then everything face up has to go to the graveyard. Bet you money that is a ghost trick card. <laughs> Maybe Shadals, but more than likely just ghost tricks. All right. Let's see the Great Noodle Inversion once again. Black Shadow Squall, Naturia Blessing. Amazonus Augusta. Okay, another fusion. Turbo Tainted Hot Rod. Pet Liger King. Silver Sword Master. There's both their pendulums. Cucumber Horse. What? It's a cu okay, cucumber horse, I guess. And Wallow, Founder of the Drudge Dragons. What in the heck are you? It's a zombie, I can tell you that much. That's uh that's a new one if I've ever seen it. Looks like uh, I might go with might go with Doom Kaiser Dragon or something. Ah, can't get in the pack. Okay. Infernal Queen Salmon. Okay. Dragonic Pendulum again. Black Shadow Squall again. Scareclaw Decline. Amazonist Silver Swordmaster. Amazon is Pet Liger King, Cucumber Horse, Catalyzer, and Baku the Beast Ninja. It's a ninja or ninjutsu art. There's another one. Another new ninja to add to the collection. Four. Okay, Tear Laments Grief. Laughing Puffin, Underworld Ritual of Prediction... Ah, Prediction Princesses. Cool. Didn't know they were going to be in here. Blackwing Twin Shadow, Tilting Entertainment. Don't know what it is, but it's got trains on it. My brother will very much like that one. Heartbeat, Goaty Cosmos, Amazon is Secret Arts. And, oop, oop, it's a secret rare. The Bestial Lubellion. The Bestial Lubellion. What the heck? By attributing a level 6 or higher dark dragon monster. You can only special summon this once per turn. You can send this card from your hand to the grave. Add a Bestial monster. For yeah, it's another branded. It's another branded card. Ugh, I don't know what that deck. I gotta look into brandeds. Apparently, as many as I keep pulling out of these boxes. Excuse me. Okay. Original, the original bamboo sword goes with all the other uh, bamboo equip spells. Laughing Puffin, Prediction Princess, Bib Biblio Muse, Tobari the Sky Ninja is another one. Vernasilf in Full Bloom, Omen of the Goaty. Blackwing Zonda the Dusk. There's another new one. Let's see, Soul Scissors and Black Feather Whirlwind. Ooh, is that a new Black Whirlwind? You can spe if you special summon a Dark Synchro Monster from the extra deck, 
Target a Blackwing monster or Blackwing dragon that is banished or in your graveyard with less attack than that monster, and special summon it. Once per turn, if a dark monster you control would be destroyed by battle or card effect, you can remove a black feather counter from your field. That's cool that they're they're not only giving them more um, deck and graveyard play, but just also a lot more stuff that will keep them on the field. Because by the sound of it, that almost makes Blackwing Dragon usable because it can just protect itself. All right. Very nice. That is off. Whoops. Just throw the pack down while I don't I? We're off to a very good start by the looks of it. Ah, uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, we've got the original bamboo sword again. The Curse of Aramatir. Yorishiro of the Aqua. Tobari the Sky Ninja. Amazonist Spiritualist. Decisive Battle of Golgonda. Is that another, yep, yeah, another Fallen of Albaz. Scareclaw Twinsaw. Hanshi Kyudo Spirit. What the heck is that? Don't recognize that one. Vernasylph of the Misting Seedlings. It's a duck. It's a strange looking duck. I can tell you that much. All right. Second to last pack from this first side of the box. Stars align across the Milky Way. This is something to do with rituals. Yuri Shiro of the Aqua. Scareclaw Decline, Salmon, Queen, Amazon a Spiritualist, Kashtira Preparations, Tear Lament Scream, Naturia Mole Cricket, and, oop, that's an Ultra, it's an Ultra, Mitsu the Insect Ninja. Okay, that's a new ninja, I guess. One ninja, why is a ninja ultra rare? Why? Of all things, I don't understand. But, oh well, we'll go with it. It'll work either way. All right. Frankie the Runic Fangs. Prediction Princess Biblio Muse. Silent Wolf Kalupo. Psychic Rover. Amazonist War Chief. Kashtira Ogre. Ninjutsu Art of Dancing Leaves. There's a new ninjutsu trap. Tri Brigade Showdown. And. Emirio Logic Aggregator. Whatever on God's Green Earth said it. Two plus level nine monsters, and it's a Cybers. So, no clue what that's for, if I'm going to be honest with you guys. All right, we've got Black Shadow Squall, Celestial Apparatus Tezia, Dragonic Pendulum. Uh, Bayer Rock Dragon, Amazonist Secret Arts, the Turbo Tainted Hot Rod again, Art of Dancing Leaves, another Black Wings Onto the Dusk, and Goaty Fury. I'm going to have a full Goaty deck by the end of these openings, guys. I'm dead serious. I forget how many I pulled from the first two boxes of Power of the Elements, but now a whole bunch more out of these. Alright, we've got Silent Wolf, Kalupo, Kagero the Cannon Ninja again, Bear Rock Dragon, Runic Fangs, Tier Limits Heartbeat, Iron Digger, Goaty Cosmos, Hot Rod, and oop, oop, it's Ultra, Black Winged Assault Dragon, heck yes, heck yes, pulled the coat, not just cover card, new Black Winged Dragon, I am automatically okay with that. Takes a, a tuner synchro monster plus one non tuner monster. Okay. Or special summon the extra deck from your. Sorry, guys, I'm reading this. Syn must be either synchro or special from your extra deck by banishing a tuner synchro monster and one black wing dragon from your face up field and or graveyard. All right, that's even even easier summoning mechanic. Each time your opponent activates a monster effect. Place a black feather counter on this card when that effect resolves. And if you do, inflict 700 damage to your opponent, even better than the first one. During your opponent's turn, quick effect, you contribute this card with four or more black feather counters on it. Destroy all cards on the field. Holy crap. 
infinitely better than Blackwing Dragon, not gonna lie. But you've almost got to play Blackwing Dragon to be able to pull that off, at least by the uh, summoning requirement there for banishing it from a grave. Heck yes, I will take that any day of the week, pulling that out of there. That's awesome. My night's been made, just getting that. Uh, Amazonus Golden Whipmaster, Biblio Muse, Amazonus Augusta, Milky Way, Showdown, Swordmaster, Scream, Twin Saw, and Snopios Shade of the Goatee. That's I'm I'm building a goatee deck, guys. It's coming. It is coming. Not gonna lie. Just pulling pulling this many of them, I'm just gonna have to. All right, Scareclaw Decline again, Blackwing Twin Shadow, Tobari the Sky Ninja, Laughing Puffin, Preparations, Cosmos, Full Bloom, Cucumber Horse, what is it? Blackwing, Borea Storm, The Wicked Wind, another, this one's also a tuner synchro, very nice, Dark Tuner, one of our more non-tuner monsters, all kinds of new Blackwing, and this is just the first box, all right, I got... Two more of these boxes to go, guys. We've already pulled the new Blackwing Dragon, the new Synchro, a bunch of their support, at least one of the Continuous Spell. If I have a place out of it by the end of it, I will be a very happy camper, definitely. Let's see, Black Shadow Squall, Scareclaw Divine, Bamboo Sword, Puffin, Omen of the Goaty, Heartbeat, Spirit, Catalyzer, ooh, Secret Rare, Lady Labyrinth of the Silver Castle. What the heck? Never even... If a Labyrinth card or effect of a normal trap was activated, except for her, you can special summon this card from your hand. I, th I almost think she goes with the... Um, um, I'm not for sure what that's called. The um, Lady of Lament deck. I think is what that's for because those are, that uses all like the virus traps or just normal traps in general. So not bad. I'm, I'm not sure if that's the best secret to get or not. Um, I might have to look at some of these in between videos and see what I'm, see what I'm looking at here. Uh, Yori Shiro of the Aqua, Curse of Amateur, Dragonic Pendulum. I need to stop putting those out. Bear Rock Dragon, Tilting Entertainment. Kashtira Ogre, Golgonda, Mole Cricket, Bistial, Magnumut, Magnum Hut, whatever that is, goes with, uh, really not sure what that goes with, <laughs> if I'm being honest with you. I feel like I've said that probably 50 times in one video. Would not surprise me in the slightest if I haven't. All right. Prediction Princess, Biblio Muse, Tobari the Sky Ninja, Milky Way, Aqua, Iron Digger, Pet Liger King, Soul Scissors, Spiritualist, Dynamite Power Load, the Draco Slayer. Ooh, that's a new Dino Mist card too. Nice. That's pretty good. I'm going to put that, uh, that's a Draco Slayer technically. There was actually some use for that uh, field spell that we keep pulling like 50 copies of. Two, three, four. All right, Runic Fangs, Ritual of Prediction, Tezia, Whipmaster, Secret Arts, Pet Liger King, Silver Sword, Cucumber Horse, oop, oop, Ultra, Mazin the Battle Ninja. Okay, there's a new Ninja Fusion. That's cool. I thought ninjas were a um, were just an Xyz era deck, but that's uh, they're getting some new stuff there. That's pretty cool. I think they've got a Link monster now, maybe two or three Xyz monsters. Either way, it's it's good to see them get some support. Decks, old decks like that that you know just really didn't do anything. They they deserve support more than other stuff, and at least in my humble opinion, Infernal Queen Salmon, Runic Fangs. Psychic Rover, Naturia Camellia again, uh, Preparations, Cosmos, Full Bloom, Cucumber Horse, Kashtira Birth, 
Kashtira monsters. Okay, that's... You can normal summon level 7 monsters without tributing. What? That's... Okay, that's... Honestly, that's probably like a Dark Magician Red Eyes card right there. If that doesn't have any uh, negative drawbacks to it. I'll have to read that one off camera too. But that, that just nuts. You just normal summon level 7s. No tributes. No nothing. Just... There you go. Naturia Blessing again. The Great Noodle Inversion. Rover. Grief. Zonda the Dusk. Uh, Golgonda. Warchief. Ogre. Terrors in the Hidden City. That's a... I'm pretty sure that's a sub-terror monster. In control with card effects. Monsters you control it were flip face up while this card was on the field. Okay, 1500 attack and defense. If this card in its owner's spell and trap zone is destroyed, you can target one monster in your grave. So, terrors in the hidden city. That's, um... Heck, that might wind up going in, uh, Worms. For a hidden arsenal. Now that I've, uh, unfortunately been on the receiving end of what a <laughs> decently constructed Worm deck can do. Just, uh... Yeah, don't, don't ask any questions about that, guys. Not, uh, not fun. Kagiro the Cannon Ninja... Naturia Blessing, Wolf Kalupo, Noodle Inversion, Tilting Entertainment again, uh, Kashtira Ogre, Golgonda, Mole Cricket, Branded Regained. There they are again. It's brandeds are everywhere. All right, last pack of the first box of Darkwing. Can we please get another of that um, continuous spell for Black Wings? Can we please get one more? I mean, I'll settle for a black wing, but that, that spell would be fantastic. Amazonus Augusta, Arma, Ar Curse of Armator, Black Wing Twin Shadow, Naturia Camellia, Hanshi Kyudo Spirit, Amazonus Secret Arts, Ninjinzu Art of Dancing Leaves, Tilting Entertainment, and it's a trap, Sprite Double Cross. Uh, sprites. All right. Well, that wraps it up for the first opening here, guys. It's going to um, pop back through here. Blackwing Assault Dragon, probably like the highlight of the pack, at least for me. Um, always love getting new Blackwing stuff. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, we'll probably mix it up with the next opening, do the 2022 Mega 10 or the Crystal Beast Structure Deck. Uh, get those out of the way real quick. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, stay tuned for more Yu-Gi-Oh! and gaming videos, and I will catch you all later. Take care, guys.